Welcome to Sports Medicine Concepts educational series addressing using the FM extractor to cut various football face mask fasteners. In this segment, we'll be reviewing face mask removal from the Revolution Series football helmet outfitted with the bow tie fasteners, including both the fixed screw bow tie and the quick release bow tie fasteners. The FM extractor handles contain an end effector specifically designed to activate the Riddell quick release hardware. To use the FM extractor quick release end effector, leave the blade safety protector in place while using the pistol grip hand position. Insert the quick release nub of the FM extractor into the quick release fastener button and depress the button fully. With an up and out motion, use the FM extractor quick release nub to help draw the quick release hardware out of the bow tie fastener while simultaneously pulling the entire fastener away from the helmet. In the event that attempts to remove the bow tie fastener using the quick release system or a power screwdriver are unsuccessful, reposition the FM extractor to cut the fastener from the helmet. Begin by removing the protective safety blade cover from the FM extractor. With the FM extractor completely closed, choose either the two or four step ratchet setting. Next, use the release lever to open the opposing ends of the FM extractor and lubricate the blade with the FM extractor lubrication wipe. Next, identify the tapered cutting valleys in the bow tie fastener. Place the blade of the FM extractor in between the face mask bar and the cutting valley of the bow tie fastener perpendicular to the face mask bar. Carefully rotate the blade of the FM extractor so that the cutting surface of the blade rests in the cutting valley of the fastener. Next, secure the anvil of the FM extractor on the face mask bar using the semicircular notch. If it is not possible to get the face mask bar into the semicircular notch, rest the FM extractor superior notch on the face mask bar. With the anvil secured, begin ratcheting the FM extractor to transect the bow tie fastener. After completing the cut, push the release lever to disengage the ratchet mechanism. If the FM extractor does not disengage from the helmet or fastener, simply use the anvil as a pivot point and carefully rotate the FM extractor downward to gently remove the blade from the helmet shell or fastener. Repeat the process on the other side of the bow tie fastener, being sure to lubricate the blade between each cut. The result of this process will be that both ends of the bow tie fastener will fall away, leaving a square remnant that the face mask can easily clear during face mask removal. The forehead fasteners on the Revolution football helmet resemble smaller, less bulky versions of more traditional loop strap fasteners. This makes them quite easy to cut using the same FM extractor techniques for cutting through traditional forehead loop strap fasteners in the event that removal using a power screwdriver is unsuccessful. In the event that attempts to remove the fasteners using a power screwdriver are unsuccessful, there are two techniques for cutting the Revolution forehead loop strap fasteners using the FM extractor. Position the FM extractor by resting the anvil and blade firmly on the helmet shell above the face mask bar on opposite sides of the fastener. Begin ratcheting the FM extractor, ensuring the blade and anvil remain firmly against the helmet shell. Transect the loop strap at its midsection and release the face mask. If your initial attempt does not result in a complete transection of the loop strap, do not attempt the same process. Rather, reposition the FM extractor by resting the superior notch of the anvil on the face mask bar. Reach the blade across the fastener and make a second cut that will result in a half inch piece of the fastener falling away. This gap will provide enough space for the face mask to be removed. You may elect to adopt a two cut chasm nest technique for cutting through these forehead loop strap fasteners. Securing the anvil to the face mask bar using the superior chasm nest of the anvil on the face mask bar Reach the blade across the fastener, tip the blade forward to allow the anvil to grip the face mask bar, and cut the loop strap above the top of the face mask bar. Leave the anvil in place and rotate the handles of the FM extractor to gently pull the blade away from the helmet shell. With the anvil still secured to the face mask bar, place the blade below the face mask bar and make a second cut. These two cuts will result in a one half inch piece of the fastener falling away. This gap will provide enough space for the face mask to be removed. When securing the FM extractor anvil to the face mask bar using the superior chasm nest, be sure to always tip the blade of the FM extractor forward far enough to allow the forks to grip the face mask bar. This will prevent the FM extractor anvil from slipping off the face mask bar while cutting fasteners. This concludes our discussion on using the FM extractor to cut the Revolution bow tie style face mask fasteners. Should you have any questions, please do not hesitate to call on Sports Medicine Concepts.